Welcome back to Ohio and Company. A new graduate program at One Ohio University helps bridge the gap between business and technology. Joining me with more on Muskingum University's Master of Information Strategy Systems and Technology degree is Program Manager and Informatics Professor Mary Kaufman mm -hmm. and Program Participant and CIO of Genesis Healthcare Systems. This is Ed Romito. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Guys. Thank you. Mary, let's start with you. We want to talk about this so-called MIST program. Yes. Tell us a little bit about what this is. Well, this program is like an integration of an MBA and an MIS combined, and it's designed to meet today's leader where they are to take them into the future, to really strengthen their business and technology acumen. And you've had so many people go through this. Kind of tell us wh where they are in life, kind of when Good. they decide to enter this program. Well, we are in our third year of programming, and we expect to be at full enrollment, and we're delighted that we've had such a great response. People are um, really across the spectrum. We have top-level business leaders, such as Ed Romito, with mm -hmm. me today, um, and, and as well as entry-level people who have a few years of experience out of college, and they're doing dynamic, life-changing things, learning how to apply technology in new ways. And how does it work? How do you balance, you know, keeping your job with all this? The program is fully online. We have students from across the country, you know, mostly regionally, but we do have inquiries from around the world. That's exciting. So it's fully online. Um, most of the courses are you meet once a week, but it's all through today's business communication platforms and it's totally flexible. So people are working full-time while they're engaging in MIST. Almost 95% of our people have a full-time job or more than full-time mm -hmm. with family. And they balance it by engaging in the program either full-time or part-time. So they can choose to engage in each term. And I know, Ed, you've been through the program. Tell us how, what your experience was like. Yeah, it's, uh, it's been a great experience, actually. Uh, I've been looking for master's programs for about three years now. And I ran across, in my own backyard, um, the MIST uh, program out of Muskegon University. And the things that really appealed to me were the, the balance between work and family, but also the ability to, to apply real world uh -huh. skills. And, and the, the projects that are, are used are, are real world projects. They're not theoretical. Um, and the online, the online focus is, is really beneficial to help with the balance of, of the uh, you know, work and family and school. So tell us more about the projects and the kind of coursework you did that really helped you grow. Yeah, each each course has what's called a charge, and and you you, you set the charge up where it, it presents you a real world world problem. For instance, um, the last class I was in, we had to develop a business case for a a business that we wanted to start, and we actually had to present this to Ohio Tech Angels, which just as if we were asking for funding from from that that group. Um, so it really gave us a sense of what it would take in order to to accomplish that. And has the the MIS program helped your career in any way, or? Um, it's been very beneficial from day one. And Mary was the first one to tell me you're going to apply things the day you start the class. You're going to apply those, and mm -hmm. and that is ex very true. Um, I have what I've learned, um, and and MIS really focuses on innovation. A lot of the softer skills. Um, that people need to use to balance IT and business, mm -hmm. and MIST really helped me develop those, and, and I use those every day. And I continue to learn uh, in the last couple of classes that I'm in. So would you recommend this to, to other people, your colleagues, your friends, your neighbors, anybody who will listen? <laughs> yes, yes, without a doubt. I would recommend it to any, I would recommend it to fellow CIOs, executives that are in the industry, uh, all the way down to, as Mary had mentioned, um, you know, people that are just getting started in their careers this program sets you up or builds upon skills that you developed you know, over the years, uh, uh, regardless of how much experience you have. So it's pretty cool we have this in Ohio, huh? It's, it's <laughs> very good. And Mary, if somebody's interested in this, mm -hmm. how do they get more information? How do they enroll? How do they get involved? Very simple. They go to our website, and we offer w webinars about every other week. They can check out the program live. Uh -huh. and they can apply online and connect with a faculty member to get their questions answered. Well, and I know you said it's in its third year, yes. so the word is starting to get out. I, yes. I'm sure that's probably the most challenging for you is just to get the word out, and that's why you're on Ohio exactly. Company, you know, get, getting the word out mm -hmm. on the program. But mm -hmm. I know once people get involved, people like Ed become very passionate about it. Yes. Well, it changes their life in a very positive way. 
Well, isn't that nice to be a part mm -hmm. of that? <laughs> yes, it is. Connecting people to their potential is our vision. So, so how, you know, and as you keep doing the program, do you do different tweaks to it as, as you get some feedback from we the do. students and things? Every project is really based upon what's happening in the current climate because our program is built on a model of learning called constructivism, which mm -hmm. believes that we learn through problem solving. We learn when we solve problems. We learn when we, through social negotiation, we talk, talk and debate and challenge one another. And we learn through connecting with our environment. So we have to stay relevant. So each project is created in a relevant today's environment, looking at the landscape of business and technology for today. And that's so important because it changes so quickly, doesn't it? Ed? Yes. Yes. The, the the pace of change is incredible, and to have you know, and Mary is, is is right on it. All the courses that I've been in, there's reflection is a very important mm -hmm. part of this. And it's not only you reflecting on your own learning, but it's reflecting mm -hmm. on the program. How can we make this better? Yeah. How can we make it more real world, mm -hmm. so that you walk away with the skills that you need to to really be successful. Mm -hmm. Well, Mary Kaufman from Muskingum University, thanks for being with us. Ed Romito, thanks for joining us Thank as you. well. Thank you. And for more on Muskingum University's Master of Information Strategy Systems and Technology degree, just log on to muskingum.edu and click on MIST, that's M-I-S-S-T. Next on Ohio & Company, well, we're gonna have much more for you, so stay right there.